Afternoon, parents in El Dorado County are reacting to a COVID case at the Rescue Union School District. Now, this is one of the few allowing on campus learning. Here's CBS 13's Heather Jansen. It looks like any other Tuesday in El Dorado Hills. Lines of cars dropping off kids, parents walking their students to class. But here at Lakeview Elementary, only more than a week since its first day, the campus is working through its first positive coronavirus case. Uh, it does concern me, yeah. Lori Westerman recognizes how some parents may be feeling back on campus not long after learning of this positive test. But Lori and other parents like Sarah Herringer feel confident in sending Sending kids back to class. I mean, the student wasn't in contact with my kids as far as what they let me know, and the school has taken amazing precautions. Some of those precautions include mask requirements, increased sanitation, and a hybrid model with some students studying from home. After this positive test, the student's entire class of 11 is distance learning for two weeks. Rescue Union School District Superintendent Cheryl Olson says safety is always their top priority. If we want to keep our schools open, even in a hybrid model, we need to. Um, Take the health and safety procedures very carefully and take close attention to them. Superintendent Olson and other parents here recognizing this is the first case, but certainly may not be the last. So, how many cases would they have to see to close the entire school? The superintendent says 5% of people would have to test positive. That means about 28 students and staff on campus would have to test positive for the virus.